Hi, my name is Olivia Worth. I'm a junior from Lincoln East. And this poem is called The Day the Music Died. February 3rd, 1959, Clear Lake, Iowa. On this day, there was silence. Instead of the iconic ballads of Buddy Holly, Richie Valens, and J.P. Richardson, there was a void. As the news of the plane crash was relayed, halting half-steps pierced ears across the world. On this day, four men were lost, the three musicians and the pilot. As Don McLean coined it in American Pie, the day the music died. For Buddy Holly's wife, Maria, the news of the plane crash was relayed by pixelated news anchors droning through her television screen. The day her music died. When a body is buried, we always accompany it with music. I don't know if this is supposed to make us feel better or if this is bridging a gap that words cannot describe, but what I do know is the times I cry the most at funerals are during the songs. The dissonance of life and death never fails to bring me to my knees. Before Joanne lost her battle to breast cancer this year, she pre-requested Christmas music at her funeral. Being bedridden by chemotherapy and the silent chokehold of an overwhelming cancer, she was too weak to make it to her church's Christmas service. This March, a room full of saddened souls wept to songs meant to convey holiday cheer. I wish cancer would have given her one last encore. The day our music died. But a body doesn't have to be six feet deep to mute the music of our souls. The issues of our culture have transformed into distorted instruments. The politicians who have normalized the sounds of the gunshots. It's all of us. The average people who pretend not to hear the cries for help from within our own cities. Sometimes it's the anthems of our culture that drown out the flourishing in our souls. For my family, Burying my great-grandfather drowned us in a wave of unimaginable pain. As 10 kids and a wife of 75 years put him in the ground, there was one note ringing among the minor chords. Bubblegum. My great-grandfather always had bubblegum to give to the kids. We buried him with his bucket of double bubble. The day our music died. But I will never be six feet under. There will be no blush on my cheeks to remind you of the life I once had. Cremate me because no one needs to dwell on my passing for that long. Write me into a eulogy, into a symphony. Burn my body to a new kind of music. Create art out of me. Don't let me hear your pain as I go. The day the music died. <laughs> 